Hi, everybody. This is Ian Lamont, author of Lee Media and the founder of two e-commerce businesses, an Amazon seller for many years, and also I, op- I operate a Shopify store. And I've recently connected it with, with TikTok, so I can run TikTok ads, and also I have a TikTok account for my business. Um, I've discovered in the catalog manager that there's a problem when some of your products are synced to TikTok, that it automatically rejects them for various reasons. Sometimes the reasons are legitimate, sometimes not. So taking a look at these products that we have, uh, we have 68 items total. And you can see most of them say available for TikTok marketing and TikTok TikTok shopping, and it says in stock. Sometimes you'll see one that says, it says it's in stock, but it says unavailable. And this means it's been rejected for some reason. And actually, if we go to the third page, of my items, you can see that almost all of them are unavailable. There's just a few that are available, most are unavailable. And here's how to appeal their automated uh, removal from your catalog. So just click on the name of the product and you'll see in the right corner here, your advertised product has been suspended. It might have been disabled due to violation of our advertising policies. And if you click on the policy, it'll show all kinds of scary language about the stuff that they do not want you advertising or even including in the catalog. And these are things like uh, weapons, um, you know, prohibited items like, you know, drugs. Uh, Maybe there's some issue with uh, animal parts and things like that. And of course, we're not selling anything like that. Actually, let's just scroll down and see some of the crazy things. You know, adult sexual products, police, military, gears, political ads. So these are things that we're not doing, and we're not in a restricted industry. I mean, we're basically selling something that genealogists use. It's nothing It's nothing illegal or anything like that. So to appeal, click on the button that says appeal. And then you have to um, click on continue. And then they'll say um, reason for appeal. So what I do is I actually have... A quick, a quick uh, explanation of why my product is not illegal. It's genealogy stationery made of paper. It's for people researching family trees. I make it clear that it's not a forbidden product or forbidden industry, and it's not violating TikTok policies. I just copy that, and then I paste it over into Reason for Appeal. And the reason why I just copy and paste is because I have to do this over and over again because there's many of my products were rejected that way. And then I click Appeal. And so I found that currently, uh, this is in early 2022, it takes about two or three hours for them to uh, review the appeal. I don't know if it's automated or they actually try to have human beings looking at it. Um, But in this case, all of my older items that I've appealed already, almost all of them have been successful. There's been a few that are not. I'll have to look into those later on. But this makes it possible now for me to advertise these products. Uh, For more information on how to get the most out of your Shopify store, selling on Amazon, um, you know, uh, using Amazon advertising, marketing. I have all kinds of videos about this. If you go to leanmedia.org, click on video or blog, you'll see some of these uh, posts that I have. And also, if you're following this on YouTube, if you could uh, like the video and then follow, subscribe to the Lean Media channel, I'd I'd greatly appreciate that. And I usually release a new video about once or twice a week. This is Ian Lamont signing off. Thank you so much for watching.